My team so always, you know, Papa, when I look at you, I say, you know, blessed be God for this great, great gift that he has given to us. Say, I just want to say happy birthday to my father. I am so proud. I am so happy. Today, I just feel like lasting time just to thank God for the 29th in which you were born, a death which, you know, the earth will ever remember where a man was born and left footprints under the sun on this earth made the made, shook the globe with the message of Christ tell to many people you have done so great things you have been ministering to be into us you have taught us the right thing you have taught us to stand when there is hell when there is storm when there is rain we remain fixated as we see you also in grounded in the same and fixed in the same and your focus has never changed it encourages us as the world gathers around to celebrate the birthday i also join to celebrate the birthday of the great great man the world has ever seen dr abel damant i remember before i met you never knew anything about the bible never knew how to interpret it never knew what is the doctrine of christ we never i never knew even what it does eternal life mean i never know knew what does it mean when the bible says my sins are forgiven i never knew what the bible means when it says jesus christ i just knew head knowledge just knew motivation all those people never understood christ but after just few months of venturing and following the religious way teachings I have been catapulted to a place where I will never be the same again in my life. And I've told my one thing to my heart, listening to you, learning from me, because I know that what I have learned is just 0.01% of what I need to know. And I will make sure I sit at your feet to study and learn. And also the world is celebrating all over the globe, celebrating your birthday, people of different calibers, pastors, East and West, sons, daughters. I also joined them to say, Thank you, Lord, for sending us a man who is firm on a mission. Sometimes we face some challenges. Sometimes we come across hard things. But you know, when we look at your determination on the gospel of Christ, on how far you have gone, how far you are willing to go, how far you are willing to bear the burdens in spite of everything that comes right and center, you are focused on Christ. It gives us also that same courage to keep on going, knowing that you know that the spirit we have in Christ is not of giving up but of pushing forward and as we see you press forward not getting tired feed us day and night 30 days of glory 60 days of glory extended days of glory then again we come to bible school mentorship homecoming you are never tired your energy is very commendable and i just want to thank god for your life and say many more years to your life that may god protect your whole family your three daughters and all your family and we pray Lord that one day in the same city in Canada in Winnipeg we'll be able to host to see you sit down and just listen from your counsel and learn many more things and we are blessed with you and we thank God for your life and we know that this is the beginning greater and more things will happen and in this city also we witness a change in the name of Jesus. Thank you so much for continuing teaching us. The same energy is coming to us. We continue to learn and we are waiting to see you one day land in this city in Winnipeg. Happy birthday, Papa. Happy birthday, my man. Happy birthday, my life coach, my pastor, my teacher, my great, great coach. I love you and I honor Live from Winnipeg. Happy birthday. Wish you all that all and your family celebrate joyfully in Jesus' name. Mr. Fabrice, your son, signing out from Canada. I love you so much, Bob.